What's up guys, in this video we're going to be opening up 120 booster packs from 4 booster boxes of Silver Lance latest Japanese sets which also released alongside Black Jet Black Spirit which we did a video yesterday, this one will go after that one um, So yeah, literally just got my delivery in uh, didn't, I ordered more Jet Black because in my opinion Jet Black is better than this set but we'll open this set, we'll show you what you can get in here so you guys can work out if this is a set for you uh, If you want to check out the Jet Black video, I'll put it on the end of the video So you can click it, I'll put it on the end card So yeah, let's see what we can get, loads of cool old arts in here But yeah, let's see what we can pull from 120 booster packs Yo guys, so as the intro showed, we had 4 booster boxes, 120 packs I mixed them all up so we get like a nice random feel for it So we should get a minimum of 4 secret rares um, The cards that are in this set, you had Tornadotus, uh, Santa Quanda Ice Rider Calyrex, obviously, which is the main Pokemon of this set. But Leopard, Glare and Rapidash, which might be the popular one for this set. But um, yeah, nothing much for Canyon as well. So this set is not my favorite. We just opened a bunch of Jet Black Spirit. Um, that video is going live. Um, that video is live yesterday so you can go watch that video and compare it to this video but if you're watching this video because you're looking to buy these booster packs we'll show you what you can get so yeah let's get into it but i want to show you the promo card so this was a jet black promo card obviously you have celebi in that set and because you have sanaconda in this set you have the alternative art sanaconda uh silver lance promo so yeah we have loads of these silver lance promos as you can see we have about 40 of them here so we got a bunch of them like boom so many so if you want to stay tuned um we sold some to our youtube members for a little bit cheaper but if you want to join our YouTube memberships, get stuff cheaper, uh, join, but then they're also on our eBay, cheapest on eBay, but you can get them even cheaper, 10% off anything on my eBay, um, or with, via the Discord, but yeah, let's see what we can get here, um, boom, boom, alright, so we're going straight to the rare, because 120 booster packs, don't want it to be a super long video, so, boom, boom, ooh, Sanaconda VMAX, that looks kind of cool, I'm the biggest Sanaconda fan, so, um, let me know what you guys think of that one. Santa kind of VMAX there. We got Ice uh, Rider, um, was it Calyrex, I believe? So I haven't played that expansion yet in the Sword and Shield game. I haven't played any of the expansions in the Sword and Shield game. I haven't played of it since about well, last year. Um, but but we've got Santa Conda here. V. But yeah, I need to play the expansions. I'll do it soon or one day. Usually what I do is I play the Switch on like the, in the airports and stuff like that. Obviously when Sword and Shield came out, I played those when it came out. Every new game I play, but like, I haven't played, bothered getting expansions. I never really got expansions for games, but here we go. We got Ice Rider Calyrex here. Let's go. But yeah, the expansions for this, like getting into TCG more, I really need to get into it. By, get the expansions, understand the storyline, etc. So definitely we'll have to do that before Chilling Rain comes out. Um, but boom. Oh, Santa Conda as well, VMAX again. So yeah, like I said, all the packs are mixed up. They're not in order of what booster boxes they came in. So the secret rares can be anywhere. So yeah, it makes it a bit more fun because if you're going box by box, then we like, oh, secret pulled, let's go to the next box. So this way we can just go through, open all the everything because you don't know where anything's gonna be. Plus you can get two secret rares in a box. And there we go, we've got a full art secret rare Ice Rider Calyrex here. So boom, let's go. We'll take that. I'll take that, that's not a bad one. As long as it's not a Volcanion full art or a, I don't know, Santa Connor full art, like a regular full art. Cause you can't get the alternative art, even a tornado just, I don't want to get that. Leopard, everything's not great. I think Galarian Rapidash, cause that has a little bit of a fan base because the Rude Hollow here and the Ice Rider Calyrex are the only two good ones to probably to get. Apart from the alternative artworks of some of them like uh, tornado has got alternative art etc but come on let's see what we can get boom nothing there should have opened all these with scissors but i want to just do it through on the video so we can just open them just like they are but oh another v max ice rider here so we'll put that on the side so yeah let's go so yeah let me know what you like on the set maybe you're opening this set for the full art trainers maybe like Melanie or Doctor, there's Phony, Phony there. So I've just got the set list on the screen as well. So obviously first time opening this. So yeah, it's good to get the set list up. Really, really helps talk about the set, etc. and what is in there. Um, but boom, let's go. All right, got Porygon Z. Oh, is that right? Yeah. But boom, we should, I don't know, there's rainbow forms as well, the golden secret rare 
is Bronzong, so again, not a nice, like, jet black, you have Electrode, which looks really cool with the black and blue, or Volcanion V, bro, I never think I saw, I'd see Volcanion in V form, to be honest, well, this early on as well, it's only second year of Sword and Shield, but, Volcanion V, I don't know, it's just because we see him so much in Steam Siege, etc, so, it's a bit weird seeing him again, but yeah, you also got him in, like, Unbroken Bonds in Hollow Rare form, uh, what well, other set seats then? Let me know, guys. But yeah. Oh, this I like this artwork because this one's done by Arita, and you can just tell how cool it is. Shale, not a fan of the Pokemon, but it is an Arita artwork, and you kind of like it, the character, because of that. Gives him that nice look. But boom, Mr. Arita artwork. Tenadatus. I can't pronounce that. Tenadus. Tenadatus. I can't pronounce it, honestly. But. Sometimes I can't do it. Sometimes people open Japanese like that. I think that is probably the safest bet to open it. Yeah, nothing there. Can we do that often? I don't think so. It's just too long. Yeah, going down the middle is a bit long, but we'll just do my normal way. Sometimes you can get it easily, but like this is not, it's not going. So we'll just do that. But yeah, sometimes it's easy to open, sometimes it's not. I don't know. Yeah, these, sometimes, I don't know what's going on, guys. But yeah, Ice Rider. Calyrex here, regular V. Have we pulled the regular V before yet? Can't remember, because I'm covering up all the pulls. Because we don't have much space. We have, what, 120 packs in front of us. Look, like, that is not opening. Sorry, guys. Take a little bit longer to open it, but... Yeah, let's get into it. Ooh, there you go. Got, what's this one called again? I believe Taurus, yeah. I like the artwork of that one. So nice, nice artworks. I like how they're not CGI for a lot of them now. They're more hand drawn, and that's what we want to see from Pokemon. We don't want to see CGI. CGI is not cool. Hand drawn is cooler, but like and rock the dark version there. Uh, oh, there we go. We got Doctor Full Art Secret. So second Full Art Secret pulled, um, or second Secret pulled. So we should get two more left in the box. But Doctor Full Art. Is this kind of a waifu one? Let me know. I'm not into it. So, you guys who are collecting that, gotta let me know down in the comments. So, yeah. Boom. So, that will be on eBay. Uh, I don't think there is a card I'll keep in this collection. I'm just gonna open four boxes. Like, I've got 40 boxes, 40 plus boxes of Jet Black, but this set, I've only got 10. I'm opening four myself because I'm doing 120, 100 plus boxes each for the channel for myself to open, and then the rest will do box breaks off. Uh, I might open some more Jet Black since I have so many for myself uh, and try and pull a Rainbow Celebi or something like that, but yeah, let's go, let's see what we can get, boom, nothing there, boom, so let's go, alright, got Lycanroc there, alright, we got Ponyta, and obviously, is this the same one from the English promo card, or is it a different artwork, well, let me confirm that for you right now. So this is the exact same artwork of the one from, as you can see, this is the English, this is from the V collection box that we did a video on. So the exact same artwork. So what we, will, we won't see this in uh, Chilling Rain because we already have the promo version. What we'll probably see, like we've seen with the Surfetch and Alex Kazam with Voltage, we'll see the full art and the alternative art in Chilling Rain. Um, so yeah, that's a little bit, uh, if you like the ponytails, that's a little bit uh, information for you. Um, but yeah. So that's how, that's how you read, like, if you look at Viv Voltage, there is no Surfetch V, there is no Alakazam regular V, but there are full art versions, because the promo cards that were in the Japanese counterpart, the V cards, I mean, the regular Vs of the, from the Japanese counterparts were promos in the English version of it, but yeah, All Beetle had a different artwork, so that's why it's stuck, but, because there's a VMAX form in the set, so they, I guess they had to put an alternative artwork for the promo, but Sanaconda VMAX here, Oh, uh, let's go. But yeah, 120 booster packs. Let me know who opens this much. Make sure to subscribe here, guys. We go crazy when it comes to, like, new sets. We open hundreds and hundreds and hundreds of packs casually. That's the reason why I do YouTube videos. Like, so the only reason I do it is because I was opening this much packs before I had a YouTube channel. So why not just do it on camera and show you guys what we can pull out of these packs. And yeah, it's working so far. 8K subscribers. Haven't pushed this on my own other social platforms. Literally, organic free videos growing every single week so yeah shout out to everyone that's supporting but boom what is this one 
don't know the name of this, like Frostless or something like that. Because I remember uh, taking a picture of this in the new Pokemon Snap game. This one is Frostless, yeah. So I remember taking a snap picture of this in the game because it looks so cool in um, the new Pokemon Snap game. Let me know if you played that. I uh, I've been banging that out. I don't know why how taking pictures of Pokemon is so fun, but it actually is like also how I was scared of playing it like every night till I fall asleep. But yeah, let's go. Oh, Santa Conda regular V here. So like I said, we should expect two more secrets. Um, so hopefully we can find them. But boom, nothing there. Nothing there. Come on. Let's hope we get something. A V Max Secret Frostlass again. So I'll put the V in the wrong pile. We'll put that out in a sec. Nothing there. So I'm just gonna put this on bulk away. Ooh, okay, full art. Straight away has come back. We got a full art. P P Phony. So it's next spot P E O N Y. So Phony Fioni. Don't know. Well, I guess this is from the. Is it Crown Tundra the uh, the expansion for this one with the two um, Calyraxes? But yeah, like I said, I haven't played it. I haven't really looked into. Like usually, when I play games. Well, back when we used to play games like uh, Diamond and Pearl. Uh, Leaf Green, Emerald, those were the three games I remember playing as a kid. They didn't really have uh, expansions back then, but yeah, so I never really bought expansions even. Like other games, it's not really expansions you buy, so I never really played or bought expansions. Uh, but yeah, I guess it's good that we can get expansions instead of getting a new game, you just have your same game, but you add onto it, which is kind of decent. But they are expensive, innit? Expansions. How much are they each? I can't even remember, but yeah, I'm kind of stingy, but except when it comes to buying loads of packs. So yeah, you can tell we open a lot of packs. That's what happens when you get addicted to opening packs, but yeah. Even in this set, like, there's not much I want in this set. They might, I might see a card in person and be like, ooh, I actually like that. So that's the only reason I'm opening it. If I didn't have that sort of, apart from that, and as well as I enjoy opening packs, I wouldn't be opening this set. Um, I pro that's why I've only got 10, like I said, only 10 booster boxes of this set, whereas the other one I got 40 booster boxes. Um, this set obviously sold out quite fast in Japan. Well, the Jet Black did this one, I think might be available still, but um, Thunder is here, but this is more like a CGI effect, so it's not you don't have that classic Arita artwork like you do with the VMAX one, but yeah, let's go. But yeah, I just like enjoying opening. In, in the Jet Black, there's like four, five, six cards that I want in there. Most of them I'll probably go for in English, but there we got Ponytar again. Yeah, most of them I'll probably wait and try and get it in English. Um, because Japanese is like, ah, I don't need it. So for me, Japanese is like, oh, we don't really need it. I, I just, my favorite cards say like a Cherizard Rainbow or regular V. I'll try and get the Japanese and English version of it. But um, if I like the card, then I'll just go for the English one. Um, but if I really, really like it or love that card, I will try and get it in both forms, Japanese and English. Um, so yeah, in this set, I haven't got anything like that. There's nothing like that that's like, oh, I need that in English, I need that in Japanese. I don't even need it in English, so that tells you something. Like, none of this, all Cinderace, I'll keep this one. I like the Holores. I think, yeah, Cinderace here. You had the Inteleon in Matchless Fighter. Rillaboom is in Jet Black. So yeah, I'll get those three trios in the set. Oh, that would be nice, get those three. Uh, but yeah, let's go. Also, that Cinderace might be one of the pre-release promos um, for this set when it comes out in Chilling Rain. So yeah, keep an eye out on alternative artwork of that card. Will probably be the pre-release promo I've heard from rumors. But boom, let's go. Um, all right, we got Gardevoir. Gardevoir I like, but it's just a hollow. But yeah, V-wise, like, uh, guys, tell me in the comments, guys. I'm opening 120 packs just to let you guys, show you guys the set. Is there a card? Tell me a V card that you would want in your collection. Which V card is your favorite character in this set? Like, let me know down in the comments. Because for me, I can't really tell you, honestly. I don't think there is one for me here. Uh, uh, Ice Rider Calyrex is super cool in alternative V Max form, as well as the V Full Art is nice as well. But there we go. Um, I forgot to sleeve it. Um, but apart from the Ice Rider Calyrex, I'm not, it's not like my favorite character or anything, but I just love the artwork of the alternative art. So. Apart from that, there's n I, I, I couldn't tell you which is my, what card I like from here. I don't like any of them to be honest. But yeah, uh, everyone's feeling that way about Silver Lance. So um, let me know down in the comments. But yeah, the artworks are nice. You have that Rita artwork, Tenatus, etc. Um, but come on, we're just flying through these now. There's literally nothing here. 
Come on, there should be one more secret, right? One more secret to be pulled. So hopefully we can pull it. Oh, Lycanroc, Lycanroc looks crazy, but yeah. Almost at the end now, we should have one more secret. Right there we go, Ponyta again. So yeah, it's nice to show, it's nice that I have the English version to show you that it's the same promo card. Uh, same as the promo, English promo. So we probably won't see that in the actual set. Just like I said with the Voltage promos, but yeah, Sanaconda VMAX. Where are the other VMAXs? There is Calyrex VMAX, there's a Tornadotus VMAX. We got, we got all of them, but not as many. So yeah, Santa Condor got so many of but yeah, we'll take it anyways. Ooh, we got Frostlass there. We got Cinderace here. Come on, let's see what else we get. Boom. Oh, there we go, Tornadotus. By Mishirita. What other cards are by Mishirita? I've just seen this one online that was by him, and I can instantly tell the graphics are 10 times better than any VMAX artwork I've seen. Shame the character isn't the best, but lovely, lovely artwork. You can see the style of it, it's just great. But boom, come on, let's see what we got here. Oh, we got the regular Tornado Disc, and you can just tell the difference, like artwork wise. Like, look at them. You just see this one looks cool, so yeah. All right, boom, nothing there. Oh, we got slow, bro. All right, let's get this. Oh, how are we gonna open this? It's not opening, so plan B. It doesn't even have a tab there, so we'll just do it like that. Yeah. Boom, nothing there, come on. One more secret left, so the good thing we got one more secret left should be some say that and we pull a leopard full up bro did say i didn't want to pull this i was hoping we can get like an alternative artwork um but we'll take it it's not too bad i guess not too bad but yeah let's go guys let's keep going boom come on let's see what we can get guys let's go Going flying through these now. We shouldn't get another secret, however, uh, with like you saw with Master's Fighter or some of the other Japanese openings we've done, it is possible to get two secrets in one single booster box. And yeah, I have a good feeling sometimes, but we got a little bit, few packs left, and obviously because I muddled them up, there is a chance we could get two secrets. So let's go through this. Let's finish this off. Now recap, show you all the secrets at the end as well. But come on, guys. Ooh. So we got Tornado this there again. Boom. Oh, <laughs> did that wrong, but I'll take it. We got Volcanion here. They pulled two out the back and it was the hit right in the front, so that was nice. We got a um what's the slow bro? Nothing there. Come on guys, we opened 240 booster packs in total today, so which is insane because we've done 120 of each set, which is four booster boxes of each set, but Frost last there. Um, so yeah, subscribe here guys, but obviously, just flying through these, a lot of packs today, so a little bit tiring, but yeah, wait for our thousand box break, pack box break of, I'll keep putting them in the back, uh, wait for our thousand box pack box break of black uh, Jet Black, because that'll be an insane set, so many chase cards in that one. Compared to, let me know your honest opinions about this set, because for me personally, I'm not a fan of any of the characters, but you guys might be a huge fan of Galarian Rapidash, you might be a huge fan of Volcanion Ice, oh, first Leopard, regular V, but yeah, um, I don't know, I'm just not into those particularly, but yeah, you have Celebi, with Celebi and Metagross in the other one, it's a no-brainer, two of my childhood favourites in black, uh, Jet Black, so, gotta love Jet Black, and yeah, go off. 40 booster boxes of that set. So yeah, just subscribe guys and stay tuned. But not long left, and yeah, we'll show you all the secrets again in the end. But come on guys, boom. 
Boom, and last pack magic is going to be nothing there. But yeah, let's show you what we got here, guys. Boom, we have um, what's his name? We got Phony here. That's the one of the floor secrets. We got Doctor here. Um, Leopard, and then my favorite one, obviously, the first one we pulled was the Ice Rider Calyrex Full Art. So, not the unfortunately, not the alternative art because that is a beautiful card, but I do like. I, one fact, I do like the ice one more than the shadow one because I like the white horse with the blue details just looks fire but the shadow VMAX alternative art is absolutely insane but if I was to pick the two characters this would be my favorite out of the two but then Jet Black does have more of the cooler characters as you can see even from the promos like would you want the Celebi promo from Jet Black or would you want the Santa Conda from uh, uh, Silver from Silver Lance so yeah guys let me know down in the comments what are your thoughts on this set? What are your favorite characters? I'm honestly interested to see are people going for this set because obviously this set might be available still in Japan whereas Jet Black is pretty much very hard to find but uh, guys if you like this video make sure to like and subscribe and I'll see you in the next one. Peace.